Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, the Rio Plus 20 outcome document gives an important role to the United Nations system in advancing sustainable development. This year, we will celebrate 15th anniversary of SPECA program. As, and as we look forward to continue working with the countries and partners in Asia and Pacific to move from transition to transformation in the area of sustainable development, you can always count of our expertise and experience. Thank you for your attention. Now it's per capita income at purchasing power parity is 30% of the leaders. What about Central Asia? Both Kakistan and its neighbors across the Caspian Sea are doing well. And incidentally, if you go a little further uh, west to Turkey, they've been doing well. This is not a uniform thing, not doing well. Consumption can be constrained. Civil society can understand the arguments for that consumption constraint. And the public will recognize that long-term sustainable investment requires behavioral and attitudinal conscription, which is no longer the accepted route in Western economies. Countries have very little in the name of natural resources like minerals, metals, forests, and even water. Per capita availability of land is so dismal that Bangladesh has 1,140 people per square kilometer. India has about 380 per square kilometer, and Pakistan has 245 people per square kilometer. Move on the right kind of structural change, which is uh, using the industry uh, to move people, uh, you know, to create jobs which can move people from agriculture, low productivity jobs in agriculture to industry, then it could become the uh, hub of, you know, the, the biggest uh, middle class could be in South Asia. It could uh, bridge uh, in the uh, skills deficit in the world and become the uh, center of consumption you know so some 30 trillion dollars of uh, you know consumption could be taking place in south asia in the next 30 years i would like to remind that uh, india wa was one of the advanced states uh, using the uh, green revolution and uh, uh, I know, I can tell you that uh, even these, uh, some of the uh, uh, devices uh, used during the Green Revolution is applied here for, uh, for Central Asia. And we, we have also some uh, projects in mind uh, to use these uh, uh, advanced technologies uh, used maybe even in the 70s, but uh, still not used here. Uh, so, uh, uh, thank you very much, all of you. Спасибо огромное за то, что вы сегодня пришли и приняли участие в нашем в нашей сегодняшней сессии. Спасибо большое.